<coughs> Hello folks. Uh, so let me demonstrate uh, how to enter data in the timetabling app. So you need to go to timetable.snu.edu.in and uh, this time uh, all the each departments, the, the instructors are already pre-populated. Okay, and you need to log in. Okay, and make sure that you have changed the semester to spring 2021. So, so once you click on here, yeah, you just click on uh, spring, uh, spring 2021. Okay, that's where you need to enter your data. Okay, so need make sure you switch to spring 2021. Okay, and uh, uh, we have already filled in the uh, the instructors list for each department. So for each department, all the instructors are already already in there. So let me show you how to uh, uh, add in add in the cl add in classes. So okay, I'll, I'll so I'll input uh, one math courses which has uh, uh, 450 students and uh, uh, number of tutorials with 30 students in each tutorials. So to add to add courses, uh, you need to go to courses input data instructional offering. Okay, then in this drop down menu, switch to your department. Okay, let me go to click on math and add new. Okay, then just put in your course code MAT104 here, course title Mathematical Method. Mine is Mathematical Method, let's say 2. Okay, and uh, leave everything else in the coordinators put your coordinators okay and your percentage uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm sharing the hundred percent load of this course uh, so then you added that okay then click on add coordinators okay and save okay so the this is just adding the course that there, there is a course called MAT 104 and it is called mathematical method 2 Next, uh, we need to uh, fill in that this course will be divided into how many lecture sections, how many tutorial sections. Okay, that you put in here by doing, uh, clicking on add configuration. Okay, so this is where you put in that uh, this course has how many students. Okay, and uh, each lecture needs to be divided into how many lecture sections uh, and, uh, and uh, uh, tutorials. How many tutorials you want so this course has 450 students okay and uh, in the lectures so click on the from this lecture okay and then once you press on this add button you'll see this option okay so i want to have just one lecture section okay so all 450 students will attend lectures together so once you click on 450 here and press on press on tab this will this box will be automatically filled in okay and this is where you put in that this is how many minutes uh, per week this lecture is going to meet so this is uh, we meet for three hours per week okay so that goes in here then don't touch anything else okay so this much <coughs> this much info this much this much information is about that okay uh, this course has one lecture okay and that lecture is supposed to meet for uh, three hours per week then next you want to add that this course has uh, tutorials okay and these 450 students will need to be split up into number of tutorials okay and to do that you need to uh, you need to again select let's say from from this drop down menu select tutorial okay and then hit add okay and uh, then uh, I need to have 30 students in the tutorial so you press put 30 here okay once you press 30 and do tab 
this 450 students will be automatically divided into 15 group okay so once i press tab i will see 15 in this box okay so that's automatically done by the software for us then here uh, and we need to fill in that the tutorial is supposed to meet for how many minutes per week so each tutorial batch is supposed to meet for 60 minutes so that goes in here and again i don't touch anything else okay so uh, so in this in this page i am filling in that my course has 450 students okay we have one lecture section uh, all 450 students are supposed to sit together okay for uh, uh, three hours per week okay and then uh, then students have uh, 15 tutorial section and in each 50 uh, uh, section 30 students uh, this is a each each batch has 30 students okay so once uh, all this is done uh, we press save okay then so far i have told the system that there is a mat 104 it's called a mathematical method 2 i need to have a lecture of 450 students uh, in one shot and i need i need tutorials of uh, 450 students which meets for 60 minutes per week okay then you want to add okay the lectures is for 30 uh, three hours per week so is that supposed to split up into uh, one and a half hour times two or 60 minutes times three or this all three hours can meet at just one okay so you do that by uh, clicking here so once you let me go back again so uh, in here if you click on here then you'll see this button edit sub part okay so once i click on that it gives me the option to uh, add time preference okay add a room group preference and anything else uh, not too much now okay so let's add the time preference so i want this three hours to split up into two times 90 minutes lectures so i select that and press add time preference then you have to in the room group preference you must choose classrooms okay because otherwise the class might get scheduled in some lab okay so in the room group preference in the drop down menu i select classrooms and then in the next way in the property tab i select required so this one is saying that this class must be scheduled in a classroom okay then once you have selected these two press add room group preference okay then press update okay so so that takes care of the time preferences and the room requirement for the lecture let's next let's go to the tutorial okay so in this i see this is let's do for tutorials so again for tutorials i need to edit sub part and uh, again the tutorial is for one hour and i want that to meet uh, for 60 minutes per week so this is the format one time 60 at time preference and again i need the tutorials to uh, be scheduled in a classroom okay so classroom required add room group preference update okay so that takes care of the mat104 okay so so far i have uh, added this in the system mat 104 that uh, uh, the lecture are supposed to meet for how many minutes per week tutorials are supposed to meet for how many per meets per uh, minutes per week okay then finally let's add uh, the instructors okay so here you go to in add instructors assign instructors then uh, uh, only the lecturers are defined uh, uh, are, are selected for now so i can select that that the uh, the lecture is will be taken by ajit okay 
and you can leave other things uh, by default uh, the, the TAs are not decided yet so I will leave them, leave them uh, as it is okay then I'll update okay so then it, it is showing this uh, you will notice this red thing uh, red uh, color and that is representing my time preferences so so that uh, that is uh, how uh, pretty much how each course needs to be added okay in another video i will demonstrate that how can you add uh, instructor uh, timing preferences etc